Uh, it's still giving very much scalp and nobody even not try to talk to your kindred at the, the wedding because your girl in a relationship with herself. <laughs> vlog situation because I don't think I've done like a whole vlog of like my entire week in a long, a long time so we're gonna try to do that this week um it's Monday it's the start of the working week and I just got out of class I just showered I threw on some clothes because I'm actually about to run to my storage unit I gotta pay my bill and I need to get some clothes out because this week I'm flying to Virginia and I need some clothes. All my clothes are in storage. I literally don't really have anything here. So I'm gonna run a storage unit and um, run to the hair store because I gotta get some more products so I can um, color these wigs tonight before I leave out. And um, yeah, I'm starving, but I don't really have time to eat yet because uh, storage unit closes at six and it's already five o'clock. <laughs> This girl literally thinks that she gets to go out everywhere with me. Fortunately, she is coming with me today. <laughs> Cause I've never been in the house all weekend. <laughs> and she just be chilling. This is why I like her. This is like my road dog. She just be chilling. <laughs>
in storage. I can't be walking out of here with no fucking wrinkle. Look, I was already wrinkled yesterday. <laughs> but me walking out wrinkled today, that's so ghetto. I wrinkled two days in a row. Somebody might know me. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know. You're so ignorant. Wrinkled as fuck. <laughs> Luckily, I be avoiding people downstairs because I go straight to my garage. But still, oh, uh, somebody in the garage, somebody be sitting in their car like this. This bitch wrinkled as fuck. <laughs> I just ain't been going nowhere, or a, a lot of times I don't even wear clothes that require irons because they don't be wrinkled. And then when you take them out the dryer, it just, it don't be wrinkled. Like, my clothes don't be wrinkled. Yeah, I was about to say, yeah, they ain't heat taking shit off. I was about to say that, like, damn, bitch, this bitch can't throw this shit in the dryer real quick. Because he says, I don't know. Fuck you. I used to do that shit all the time, man. Especially, like, going to school. Man, wait, to wait, 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 wait. Who you calling a bitch? That's what you just did. Unconsciously, yeah. just called me a bitch. No, I didn't. You referred to me as a bitch. You refer. I was saying like, I was saying like this bitch, like I'm saying that's what they came from. I don't give a fuck. Damn, see? I was so excited for my pants to be tight as fuck. <gasps> Get the fuck out of here. Yo, Brandon, I'm about to show you this shit. Brandon. Uh, yeah. Y'all, sure. this is dumb. Now I gotta get all my pants fitted. Bro. Okay, they look normal. They look normal. I wish they were tighter, but they look normal. Until you go to the fucking side. What the fuck is that shit? But you won't feeling out like that though. That's crazy. And the ways you you couldn't have been feeling out like that even last time. That was never this big. It wasn't. No, it was uh, never this I, big. I, I mean, I feel it. I feel where you're coming from, but I don't know about. That. I can't That's believe crazy. this shit. I can't wear pants normally no more. Oh my god, the struggle. I don't want to be a part of this BBL family no more. Man, shit. Right? <laughs> well, I don't know. Wait a minute. Man, shit. Man, shit. Man, shit. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm such a fucking idiot, dog. Oh my god. Okay. This is crazy. I can't believe I can't. That is so tacky. Okay, I don't even want to wear this no more. Let me put on some regular jeans then. Damn. Let me see if it does that with regular jeans. Yeah. Damn, Brandon. My stomach must was fat. Oh my god. I cannot believe this shit. These bitches used to fit tight as fuck. These are old ass jeans. I know my ass was not that flat. Alright. You know what? Fuck it. You just gonna rock it out. I don't care how wrinkled or dusty I look, I gotta smell good. So, I'm trying to figure out. Yeah, I gotta leave up out of here. What we wearing today? What's we wearing today? I think I just want to smell fresh. So, that's what we wearing today. Yeah. This is giving me like Armani Exchange vibes. Am I the only person? I'm pretty sure I'm not, but how many of you guys over spray when you spray your perfume? Leave a comment down below. <laughs> anything else? I need like a watch or anything? No, because you already look a little bum. Is this tie of shirt situation tacky? I feel like it is. Ready to go. I decided to just rock my wrinkles. Hey Google, play Little Mermaid. You know I like to play that for my dog who bear. And I say you were a beautiful mermaid. Oh, she is. I put the red hair on just for to be Little Mermaid. Oh, I gotta put that at the brain. I'm really planning for me, but <laughs> I'm planning for her too. She really wants to go. She 
really want to go. You can't go all the time, mama. That shit ridiculous. It was waiting on rooms. I mean, everything ain't checked out good though. I mean. Yeah, he said the swelling is going to take about. They say it can take up to about six months for my swelling to go completely down, and then that sucks. And then I told him about like my feeling. Like, I was like, I can't feel my teeth. I can't feel my lips. You know. And um, and he told me like where they stitched right here, where I told him like I thought that them stitching so close is preventing me from smiling normally. He was like, well, that's where they had to cut. So when you stitch something back together, it typically, this be saying it'd be tighter. He said it would stretch out, but then he also said about the numbness that. You know, it's like not being able to feel like the teeth stuff. Yeah, like I can't feel the left side of my teeth and my lip and my chin and part of my jaw, I can't feel it. He said he's explaining the nerve. Like, something about the trauma, like it should come back. Like it's gonna just take a while, but some people don't get it back. I don't know. Um, my jaws are meeting together, which is great. Yeah, I mean, you'll get full movement back, full range of motion. Yeah, he said, so that'll just take time. And he said he doesn't have any restrictions on my food. Just eat. Mm -hmm. Just make sure you know what you can, you know what you can do. Don't do too much. Yeah, and I'm hungry as fuck right now. I'm trying to figure out why I can't connect to my damn class. So today is a new day and I woke up kind of late. I woke up at like 9 o'clock. <laughs> it's currently 10 o'clock and I literally have two hours before I need to be out the house because my flight leaves at 3.30. So I'm trying to get out the house by like noon, noon 15-ish or whatever. So I need to bathe Nalapu and pack because I haven't even packed yet. Um, I thought that I was going to wake up early to customize my wigs for the weekend, but that didn't happen. Why you don't want me to be great, Brandon? I called you like three times. You called me one time. I called you twice. Actually, I called you once on both phones. No, you did not. I only got one phone call from you. Then you gonna some three, four times. You were just lying. You literally called me one time and that was at 7.01. One ring. 7.01 and at 7.30 I called you one phone. I ain't getting no 7.30 uh, phone call. I'm just telling you that I called at 7.00 because when I called and it wasn't a One phone call. I said one phone call is not going to make me fuck up. You supposed to call me back to back. Man. You don't be great. And then when I call you, then you ignore me. All right, but you want, you want me to be, you want me to fail in life, don't you? You want me to feel it like, don't you? I got two hours before I need to be out this motherfucking house. Yeah, no, that Nala bath. And I 
I need to pack. Okay, no time, yeah, I need to be out of here by 12, 12, 15. Okay, no and I'm trying to get these AirPods. I found them on Facebook ad, obviously. Same person got the most AirPods for the fifteen forty-five dollars Brand new spigot. For $45? I let it go for about $40. $40? Mm-hmm. Forty-five. Mm-hmm. The, the real? Mm-hmm. I think he just got. I literally think he. I literally just think he got like unlimited, like a bunch of them. Yeah, but. But see, hey, look, I seen, I seen it too. So the, the, the liquidation website. Hey, this one, I say, I'm about to make plays, bro. Guys, you know you better watch out. For travel, the plug on Facebook literally charged $45 for a new pair of um, AirPod Pros. Legit, y'all can't even see that, so weird. but y'all know what it is. So now I need to pack. It is 11.24 and I have like 45 minutes max to get my shit together. So, Nala looks so cute now that she got a bag to blow up. the family his name is Hannibal hi hey Hannibal what type of dog is he mama a giant schnauzer and I just got here and my mama already telling me to pour her a this is drink it's more than wine but it's nice well I'm sorry it's my ball yes my wine is actually in the other room this is nice only for display. <laughs> Wait, only for display? So yeah. what you drinking? Oh, the drinks is on there that I drink. Oh, okay. So everything you drink is down here? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, full bar. We love it. What do you say the wine was that? Yep, she here. Oh. The wine is on the wall. Um, oh, the down here. She's not used to, she used to come in here, then you got a wine opener? Yeah, just keep twisting and just keep twisting and keep twisting and it's gonna pull itself up. Someone, someone commented underneath my, my last video and said, 
Girl, you need to get an electric wine opener. <laughs> well, we used to have one of those, but you know. She said, she said, but she said it's only because of like the wrists and the time. She said it's not good on your wrists. Yeah. Tell her, uh, Jack and I don't know if it's good on your wrists. You look like the do. Jack off. So I have um. I think they just get paid. Huh? <laughs> I think they just get paid. That's what you should have. Jack them off sometimes. Yeah, make them hurry up. Um, I have some packages coming. Where your wine glass? Oh. You want me to? Is that okay? Oh, like out there. Oh. Mom, what am I gonna do with the glass? Break it. Yeah. Oh, it's pretty. Try the other side of the hookah. Try to put that long side on the other side of the hookah. Let's see. The things are good. The reason to go with it. Yeah, eat your food. It's good. Oh, no, no, no. Take it in, huh? Mm. Yeah. No, hey. no foreplay, nothing. Mm. No foreplay. Just <laughs> <laughs> mm. See, I, that's how it's working. I guess it work like that, then. Yeah, and then what you do? I know what you do. You gotta rate the food. <laughs> The food is delicious. <laughs> okay. She really does. Oh, okay. She's like, oh, this is good. So we came in the house, had a dinner, and now I'm making dessert. Um, but it's just these um, pineapple upside down cakes. No, top or bottom? Top or bottom? Bottom. Cause what? Oh, okay. <laughs> We're gonna do uh, red <laughs> venom cherry. This is the flavor of the night. Mama, this ain't open. I'm just doing my little bird. Mama, this ain't so, open. Oh, the lighter, yeah. Mama, this stuff ain't open. Well, it's the other two. I feel like it's this one. I feel like great. You need to wash the glass. Yeah. Um, that's your napkin. I got a napkin. Where do I go? It smells good. Okay, so the flavor of night is actually great mint. I was kind of excited for the cherry, but. So you got it? This doesn't even look like great. This is great. What the hell is it? Get, you hold your child and I'll do it. Look at my damn shit. 
first of all, your tongue is too skinny. That's okay. They ain't too skinny. I have fat tongue with fat hands. Okay, let me see. Mm. We're gonna call it a night. <laughs> Say good night. Night. <laughs> Okay, so today is Friday. Um, I skipped yesterday because all day yesterday was, I was in class all day, um, I did some assignments. My little brother came, him and his girlfriend came to see me, and then I took out my mom braids. So that was all I did yesterday. Um, today is just mainly gonna be prep day. I have to go to the hair store because I never customized my um, wigs for the wedding this weekend. So I have to go to the hair store and get some bleach. I thought my mom would've had some. But she just moved here, so I she don't know she don't know what that, so I'm gonna bother her. Anyways, um, I just got on the scale again. I got on my scale like literally two seconds ago, and I done lost like two more pounds, a little over two more pounds. I'm like 118 pounds now, rounded up. I just had on some pants a second ago. I changed into this because my pants they size extra small and they still too big. Um, but I'm not mad. I'm not mad because it's giving me a head start on my fitness journey anyways. It's just, I low-key feel like if I was going to lose all this weight, I ain't really need no BBL. I could have just got, you know, lipo in the stomach and the arms if that was the case. Because it won't like I didn't have a booty before. I had a little shum shum back there before. But... I had a tummy too, so I'm a little annoyed about that, but it is what it is. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Um, but yeah, let me get up out of here because we ran out of time. I mean, y'all, I should do that. Plus I got this brown in me Curly yellow dancing on me Said she smelled a green on me And she straight from California Figured who she wanna be Tell me she like boys and girls Oh well that's okay with me Then she said My old boo let me blue I really love it So cold and so cruel So many colors Play hoes like pro tools Can't never trust them, trust them, trust them, trust them Nah, fuck fuck em, fuck em, fuck em, fuck em oh, oh, oh. When I think about it I just wanna cool with a little poop with a What's he doing? Brenda, I had to cuss this motherfucking lady out In this fucking beauty salon I mean, not beauty salon, in a beauty supply store what? Because I, I'm in the line, right? I was in the line first But I was down looking at some stuff or whatever. So, you know, she had, I saw her, she had walked up. So I had like backed up and like got behind her. And then she had like went off to the side to look at like some lip liners or eyebrow pencils or whatever. So the Asian lady was like, well, I can help whoever's next. So I stood there for like a little bit to see if she was gonna go. Cause she was still kind of like in front of me. Cause I was standing off in the back on the side. And she ain't moved. So me and the Asian lady looking at each other like, all right, well then I go up to the register. And halfway through me putting my shit throughout the basket, this fucking bitch gonna be like, um, so you just gonna jump? No, she said she's just gonna skip the line. The, the fuck, bitch, we, did you not just hear the cop? So I ignored her at first. So she was like, hello, so you're just gonna skip the line? You're just gonna jump me? I said, I'm, I said, I'm sorry, but she said that she was ready to take whoever was ready. You were preoccupied, so I'm here. And she said, I was here first. You're going to jump me? Da, da, da. I said, look, bitch. All right. So I put my stuff in the basket and I'm backing up. She's still talking shit. So she said, wait, you recognize a bitch because of what? I said, because I am a big bitch and I will trump your motherfucking ass. <laughs> so then she said, get me up out of here. She told, told the lady, she said, you know what? Let me get my shit so I can get up out of here. So I, 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 you know, I shut up at that point. So I'm like still, um, like ring, he ring the old man ringing up my stuff or whatever. And then, um, what happened? Oh no, no, no! When she walked out, 
when she was walking out and um she had said something to me i was like i said look i was trying i said look i was trying to be cute and i said i was trying to be cute and respectful but you're still trying me and she had said something else and she walked out so then that's when i came out she was looking at me and she rolled her eyes and i was like hmm. <laughs> She lives with you. Yeah, she left it there. Stupid bitch. Like, I could tell she was a little younger, but she looked like an old ass motherfucker lady wearing them big ass goggles, like goop glasses. <laughs> like, people just, why are you trying me? I am too nice to be tried, but when you fucking take me there, bitch, I will fucking go there and stop playing with me. Motherfuckers best stop up, but try me. Okay, we're back home. I've been trying to be nice, y'all. Sometimes just people always got pushy. I think she was just having a bad day. But she done met her match today. <laughs> I'm about to go ahead and um, bleach these knots finally now um, to my wigs. And then afterwards, I have to flat out my mom's hair. And then I'm most likely just gonna be up all night because I gotta wash my hair, customize my wigs, and style it and prepare for tomorrow. So. Yeah. Kindred at the, the wedding because your girl in a relationship with herself. <laughs> <laughs> 